My name is Stephanie Dean. I am a critical care nurse here at Sumner Regional Medical Center in our COVID ICU. This has been a long journey. Um, we've been at this for what, eight months now, and we are getting tired. You know, it, it's very tiring to come in to work every single day and essentially lose a family member or a friend almost every shift you work. Um, these patients are with us for weeks on end. And when we lose them, it's like you're losing your own family. Um, you create relationships with these families and patients that become so tight. And when you lose those, it's, it's very heartbreaking. It, this disease is something we have never seen before. And it's hard to explain to people unless you have actually worked with them and seen them. You know, a lot of people in their mind think, oh, it's, you know, it's just cold symptoms. It's just flu symptoms. Let me tell you, it's far more than that. It's multi-system organ failure. It's you being in a hospital with no family around for weeks, potentially months. It's you possibly never seeing your family ever again. And I feel like a lot of these things are avoidable. Just take simple precaution. I have gotten very close with a lot of my patients during all this. And there is one patient in particular um, that sticks out in my mind and they will forever be in my heart. I will never um, forget them. Them looking me in the eye and them knowing that it was more than likely gonna be the last meal. They looked me in the eye and they said, I'm going to die, aren't I? And the fear and the look in their eyes was just absolutely heartbreaking. So there's this misconception out there. Um, you know, there are a lot of people that are asymptomatic with COVID and, and that's the problem because you're around people and you're assuming that they're not contagious or they're not sick. And that's not the case. You know, wearing a mask isn't that hard. You know, we're all tired of it. But if we want to eradicate this and get this to an end at some point, we have to get everyone on the same page. Otherwise, we're never going to beat this. Let's look back to when, you know, it was a mask mandate. Um, we didn't have the surges like we're having right now. And, you know, it's, I feel like it's a it's somewhat of a selfish thing. Um, you know, there are a lot of people that think, well, I don't have these health issues. I'm not vulnerable. If I get it, I'm not gonna get sick. But you have to think about the other people around you. There's a lot of people that are susceptible and they're taking proper precautions. And by you not and you engaging with them, um, it's not right, um, you know, so if you don't want to do it for yourself, at least do it for the people around you.